Andy, this point in afternoon out there, what was it like from your point of view on the pitch? Yeah, I think it was a poor performance all around today. I think, don't think we really got started. And then that we carried that on to the... We got a little bit better, but it still was nowhere near how we can play. And we expect to be doing a lot better in the games to come. Yeah, it was quite a nip and tuck first half too. And then the first goal goes in under quite unlucky circumstances too. And then the second goal, not really many goalkeepers could do anything about that. So like, was it frustrating just the way the goals went in a way? Yeah, exactly. I mean, all three. I mean, the first one, yeah, it's... Uh, Morris putting a tackle in and it like, could go anywhere really. Normally, Lemon's just a good tackle, we go up for a corner, but it somehow just looped in into the far the far corner of the goal. And the second one, yeah, it's uh, right in the top corner, you can't do anything about that. And then the third goal, again, just tackled him and it just fell perfectly for him then to finish. Like, so, just really unfortunate goals. But like I say, we're just, we, were, we weren't at it today and we should, can't really blame him on that. And we just need to perform better. And it was pretty much the same team that started against Wigan as well. So what do you think was uh, was different about today's game from last week? Um, I think, yeah, like I say, it's not personnel because it's the same like say, it's the same team that started Wigan. But I don't know, we just didn't start right today. And then just after the bad start, we just still didn't get on the front foot and change any. Um, we did change things, but still we just couldn't get, get a foothold in the game. And obviously when you can see, it's still just a setback again. And uh, our goal in the end came too late. We couldn't get the third. And are these games sort of good to learn from in a way when when the result doesn't go your way? Are you going to take a lot from this? Hopefully. Yeah, we've got a lot of games coming up, so we can't really dwell on it too much. Take away the whatever positives we can, but also reflect on the negatives and try and make sure we don't make any of these mistakes again in the games that come. And um, we have got a lot of games, so it's, it's vital we um, kick on and perform better from the off in the next games. And it's in a way double header as well, starting at Barnsley on Wednesday night and that's going to be a tough place to go as well, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, but uh, all the games coming up really and, and they're around us in the in the table so they're must-win games really. They're, like you say, they're six-point games because if you get the three points, you stop at them getting three points as well. So it gives you a bit of leeway if you can uh, win and get away from them around the, uh, around us in the table. So. But we're going there uh, hungry for the three points and hoping to come away with it. And still a lot of games to play in December too. Like how much do you reckon this month can define the rest of the season in a way? Yeah, it's a big month. Like I said, there's a, a lot of games, so we want to pick up as many wins as we can. The games come really quick and that what they always do in this league. So we want to get as many points and climb up the table. Like I said, it's an important month.